Here's my advice for your paper one exam. Number one, use your reading time to read paper 1B. Try and process all of the weird and wonderful database or experiments and try and really get your head around what they're trying to tell you. Make sure you've got a plan for the timings and stick to it. So look in the comments below if you want a rough idea of how long you should be spending on paper 1A versus paper 1B but have an idea of when you're gonna stop and when you're going to switch. Even though you have your calculator, you do not need to use your calculator for every single question, and sometimes it's going to make you slower. So think about whether you actually need your calculator or not to solve a problem. Number four is for those paper 1B questions, check how many marks the answer is worth. Um, I've often seen students who have one mark questions who give huge answers and that is a waste of your time. So check how many marks it's worth and make sure your answer aligns with that. And lastly, whichever paper you decide to start with, try to complete that entire paper before you move on to the other one. That includes kind of putting your answers into the multiple choice grid or any of that stuff. Try and make sure that's like completely finished to the best of your ability before you move on to the other one because wasting time context switching um, is going to cost you. So you don't want to be doing that too many times in the exam. And good luck.